one for the 166 project. Um, I'm going to use a, a wash made out of uh, rubbing alcohol and we're just going to use gritty yellow and you can see what I've already started so it kind of gives you an indication of how this is going to end up. Not quite done yet but pretty much there. There's some things I'm going to add to it and then I'm going to make a little picture collage on there of the finished product but anyway I've got a little alcohol in here not much and gonna use our weathering powder this is the gritty yellow it's a little darker than the desert sand because I wanted to kinda of match what the base looked like we don't want much we don't want to make a paste out of it these weathering powders as I said before I believe a little goes a long way so we're just wanting something that will look like that just a, where you can still see the trace of it it's just barely covering if it's too much add a little bit more alcohol to it what we're going to do is, is same thing as with any wash this the reason I chose alcohol was is it'll evaporate very quickly and show you the results that way you can add more however you want to work it but just go over the car see how it's already going to collect in well that's where most of your dust and things is going to sit and just go over the all the high spots on the car and yes you want to hit your tarp a little bit as well so it gets down into the grooves we highlighted it with the dry brushing now we're letting the dust go where it wants to and you're going to brush down the whole car and any place that would stick out and be a little ledge for dust to collect that's what we're after try to get the excess so that way it just a little puddle won't hurt but you don't want much there you see it's already that's the reason I chose the alcohol it's already drying shows you results right away try to move it pretty quick so that way it doesn't leave the brush marks in it and whatnot you want to get everything including the seats any place it's going to be, you know, it's sat out, so it's going to be covered in dust. Get the seats, get the the whole car. Mainly the top, though, like I said. You can see where I've already put a couple coats on it, trying it out. see where that's already dried it gives it a real dusty look see that my hands aren't in the way but that's pretty much the end of it so the next thing you see will be the finished product thanks to everybody for watching we've uh, also picked up quite a few new uh, <coughs> subscribers I appreciate that thank you very much if you guys got any ideas about what you'd like to see, please let me know. Uh, if you try the ideas that I'm showing here uh, and they work for you, please send me the results. Let me see how you did. Um, I think it's great everybody that's been contacting me and let me know what has worked and uh, that they're going to try things. And... Uh, 
like I said, uh, stay tuned. We I got a special one coming up. Just ordered the parts for it. Um, so that one will be coming along before long. I'll uh, send a video out and let everybody know when it's going to start. But you can see right there the alcohol's dry already and there it is all dusted up. A few places haven't dried quite yet but the tarp definitely came in very well. It's all gathered at the bottom. So thank you very much and check back always. Thank you.